I'm going to invite you to do a practice. And you're going to write down, I'm going to put plinky plonky music while you do that, a few minutes. And you're going to write down what it is that you desire to create, but you're going to write it in a specific way. You're going to write it in present tense. Like instead of saying, I want to be on a beach in Hawaii, you write, I am on a beach in Hawaii. Instead of saying, I would love to smell patchouli flowers and ha ha ha, you say, I smell patchouli flowers. Instead of saying, I want or desire to be in a relationship honoring, you write, I am in an honoring, mutually respected relationship. Like that. You get that? Very simple. All right. So I'm going to give you a few minutes to write down your desires as in I am. You're describing your ideal life, what you feel, hear, smell, your ideal life. Um, in your own time evolving this. Now, I would like to invite you to look at what you wrote and create an icon, create an icon, the logo of your life accomplished. So, for instance, if I desire to be more spiritual, for me, spirituality would be the Sri Yantra or the many triangles connected like Star of David within Star of David. If I desire to be more amorous and in a love relationship, it's the heart symbols. So I create those symbols and then I find a way to combine them. Maybe the heart is interweaving the star. The, the Star of David. Maybe the Star of David is made out of the heart. Maybe it's a squiggle. So iconize it. Make a symbol that is meaningful to you. Maybe it's a letter. It can be anything. It's your symbol.
you're going to keep on working with that and refining, adding. It's like honing the mission statement of your life. You're creating and evolving the mission statement of your life in the here and now, in the present tense, and you're making the logo of your life accomplished. So you're creating a logo of your spiritual incorporation here on planet Earth. <laughs> and that is a way of actually manifesting it. Now, you can redraw it many times, you can doodle it, you can write it. What you focus on is what you get. You focus on a degree, you get that. Yeah. You focus on something, you go and you desire to get a, a, a place to live in, in a certain area. You focus on that, you get that, you make it happen. Because your intention and attention and dedication of your energy go towards that. So keep on drawing it, keep on refining what your vision statement for your life accomplished is and play with it so you can draw it on yourself with not with a permanent marker draw it on yourself you know use an eyeliner get sheets that you can it doesn't matter if it doesn't get off at the wash draw it on your body at different chakras maybe feel what it feels like if you have a love partner do it to each other Okay, or you can imagine when you're draw drawing it on yourself with your finger as if though the lover, the beloved is drawing it on you. It's amazing. Try that on your wrist right now. And it's super sensitive. And have the intention that the beloved is touching you, drawing it on you. For you are the beloved. And existence is the beloved. And we are inseparable. So you're going to dedicate your lovemaking to that. So masturbation or self-pleasure or self-honoring. You can dedicate it to that. You can decide in the beginning, this is what you focus on. This is what you're giving your energy or orgasm or ejaculation to. You're going to give that to that, manifesting that. You could, at the moment of orgasm or ejaculation or at the moment of choice, you can focus on that symbol. So you can actually look at that symbol you created, have it somewhere on the wall or available. So it really is profound. That is actually a very simple practice of sex magic. Okay, tantric sex magic. That is the practice. So I invite you to play with it. The only way to know it is to do it. And it is phenomenal. The success is incredible. So please play and practice. If you don't get it right the first time, that's great. Do it 108 times, you know. <laughs> it really is profound. Just do it. Tantra means practices. Okay. Enjoy manifesting. <laughs>